Right now, we want to get out to Danny Carlson. She's live at that <sighs> crash on US 131 in Allegan County. Danny? Yeah, Emily, the scene of 131 southbound looks much different than when we got out here about an hour ago. Back then, this highway was actually shut down. It just opened up within the past about two minutes, I would say, and the highway was backed up for another at least three miles as Allegan County Sheriff's Department, Michigan State Police were diverting people uh, several exits before this crash actually happened. Now, we were able to talk to an Allegan County captain today. He tells us that there was a wrecker on the road that was actually trying to pick up another car that had slid off into the ditch. And while he was doing that, the car that had the victim in it, the person that was injured, actually hit that wrecker. And that person was, we're told, severely injured, and he was taken by helicopter to Spectrum Hospital. We're told that the driver of the wrecker was fine, didn't have a scratch on him at all. Now, we did actually see that car. The front end was smashed up. You might be seeing that in your video right now, and it looked like the driver's side door was almost completely ripped off. It also looked like the airbag had deployed. Now, it was bright and clear out, as Matt was just talking about a couple seconds ago, and that might actually be part of the problem when we talked to that Allegan County captain today. This is what he had to say about that. I don't know if you guys actually heard from that captain, but he was basically saying a lot of times when it gets sunny like this, people think that the ice has melted and they think that it's safe enough to drive, but the road is actually still very slick. So when it is so cold like this and the salt doesn't work as well as you think it might in slightly warmer temperatures, it's always better, as we've been saying, to slow down on the roadways. Now, as we said, this road just opened back up. Allegan County said they've been dealing with about 30 crashes so far just this morning. And I actually just got some information that says all highways, all lanes of M6 are open back up right now. Now, we plan to stay on top of this story, bring you any details on our later newscasts, also woodtv.com. Live in Allegan County, Danny Carlson, 24-Hour News 8.